The Turkish Defense Industry Agency SSB, hosted a press tour aboard the Turkish Navy's future flagship, TCG Anadolu, L-400, and revealed information about the project's schedule. It was the first time defense journalists visited the Turkish Navy's future landing helicopter dock, LHD, which is currently in sea acceptance trials. The head of SSB, Professor Ismail Demir, delivered a speech to the participants, giving some significant information about the timeline of the project. Ismail Demir emphasized the indigenous contribution to TCG Anadolu by highlighting that 131 Turkish companies were involved in the project and the indigenization rate is about 70%. Demir also pointed out the level of the Turkish shipbuilding industry, saying, we worked with a foreign company, Navantia, in the design and construction phase. But at the level of our shipbuilding industry, we are capable of designing and building such ships with national resources. Ismail Demir also shared information about the forthcoming developments of the project. We launched TCG Anadolu in May 2019 and started sea trials in June 2022. We are planning to complete trials and deliver the ship by the end of this year. Ismail Demir also explained the specifications of the future landing helicopter dock, LHD. The TCG Anadolu will be the largest ship of the Turkish Navy with a length of 231 meters, a width of 32 meters and a displacement of 27,436 tons and will strengthen the Turkish Navy's force projection capabilities. The ship will have a top speed of 20.5 knots and a range of 9,000 nautical miles when fully loaded. TCG Anadolu has reportedly planned to be transformed into a drone carrier after the US broke the partnership with Turkey on the F-35 JSF project. As a result, Baker, a Turkish drone manufacturer, announced in early 2021 that it was working on a specific UCAV called TB-3, an improved and folding wing version of the combat-proven TB-2 drone that would be deployed aboard TCG Anadolu. Ismail Demir stressed that the UAV integration system process will continue after the delivery of the TCG Anadolu. She will be able to conduct air operations with TB3 drones after the system integration is completed. He also underlined that Bayraktar Kizilelma, MIUS, unmanned fighter jet and HURJET aircraft will be deployed to the future landing helicopter dock, LHD.